Um, <clears throat> here's some birds here, but it is pretty quiet. It's uh, like you said, it kind of has its own quietness to it, I guess. Like a really quiet place. Uh, you can hear the cars and stuff, but right here, in the presence of all this, it's pretty, uh, pretty quiet. Which is kind of odd. A little bit odd. A little bit. Uh, found a lot of good pictures so far. Still on the search. There's probably about 60-some people scattered throughout the, the uh, cemetery. But it, uh, it definitely has its morbid beauty. It definitely has a morbid beauty to it. And it goes on and on and on and on and on and on and on. Just keeps on going. Anyhow, thinking about you. I tried to call you. You're probably on the phone. I know how it is. If I call, you're like, ah, he'll call back. I'll talk to him later. No big deal. It's interesting. It's a, uh, I think a family plot that was supposed to be for the whole family. And it only wound up being for... People. So you got somebody over there. And somebody over there. And nobody else. Interesting, huh? Anyway, the place is uh, pretty fascinating. All the stuff is just rolling hills of uh, monuments and gravestones and big trees and old family plots. Whole families in here going back to the 16th, 1700s or before even. So it's been here a really long time. Pretty amazing. Kind of creepy. There was a uh, big storm once down through here, and uh, a bunch of trees had fallen, and some of the uh, graves had popped open. <laughs> you couldn't see anything really, but it was interesting nonetheless. Uh, hanging out with my buddy later, um, getting into the work. You know, this would be uh, one of my buddies here. <sighs> I don't know if you can see it. There we go. Let me get. Uh, this thing to focus all the time. 1914, there's uh, some going all the way back to like 16 and 1700s. It's uh, pretty interesting stuff. Anyway, uh, makes for some neat pictures. <clears throat> and um, ad-libbing on, uh, on video, as you know, is, is not that easy. Anyway, um, continuing on, having a good time. Say goodbye, buddy. So that's a uh, yeah, pretty okay. decent view of the ongoing uh, black some of that light. Just endless uh, tombs and things in this place. They just go on forever and ever and ever and ever and ever in all different directions. It's pretty amazing. I try to cut down on my adjectives, things like wow and amazing and fantastic and it's hard for me not to do that. Anyway, all right, we're on the other side in the uh, cemetery on the hill uh, from where we were yesterday. You see the, uh, the river and the city down that way. And uh, up here on the hill, still at Hollywood Cemetery, taking pictures. Uh, Anyway, I'll show you uh, Madison's uh, tomb here in a minute. <clears throat> we were trying to get some pictures over there, so I uh, scrammed out of there. Just kind of walking around. <sighs> anyway, it's a... Uh, it is a cemetery, but it's beautiful and interesting all at the same time considered a, uh, I think it's on one of the top landmarks of the country, if I'm not mistaken. 
yeah, this has been a fun, fun outing. I like coming here. It's pretty cool. There's a huge mausoleum down there. You can see right above where the sun is, there's a uh, big mausoleum you can actually walk inside. That's where they put people in drawers. Literally stick them in the wall. Stick your name on there. I'll probably more than likely be in a uh, balsa wood box in the backyard, which is fine with me. So, anywho, I'll show you Madison next. Uh, this is uh, Madison's tomb. They said it's kind of uh, dark and foreboding. Interesting. Got that European goth thing going on. And then down here. One of the governors. I don't know what that is. Dolly is down here somewhere. At least I remember her being down here somewhere. I don't know. It was down there anyway. At one point. Like I said, they changed all this up. Somewhere around here. On my way back to the car. Uh, that was fun. Uh, the legs are sore. I'm out of shape. Anyway, Hollywood Cemetery. It's a fun time. People are uh, calling it a day. Get this thing to work like it's supposed to. <clears throat> so, I love you very, very much. Hopefully you can come here sometime. I will talk to you later. Back in the car. Um, I was glad I was able to uh, talk to you while I was out there. Uh, I love you. And I miss you.